anti-war protesters in London show their anger towards Tony Blair outside the Chilcot inquiry into the Iraq war. They claim he snuck into the inquiry after arriving early in the morning ahead of protesters who are calling for the former Prime Minister to face a war crimes tribunal. There has to be some kind of accountability. There has to be some sort of um, uh, fallout for him. That's very important, not just for historical reasons, but you know, we want to send a message to politicians in the future. If you lie to Parliament, if you lie to the country, if you take us into further catastrophic wars, there will be a price to pay. That's why we're here. Many activists feel cheated after it emerged letters exchanged between Blair and former US President George Bush will not be made public. He is still strutting the world stage as a so-called peace envoy in the Middle East, etc., instead of being in prison in The Hague for the war crimes that were committed. We hope that any inquiry will achieve something approaching the truth of what actually happened. Uh, we know pretty much that there was something going on between Blair and Bush long before he told his cabinet, long before he told Parliament and long before he told us that he had agreed to go to war. Uh, he should be taken by the police and arrested for war crimes well and he done. should be put on trial at the International Court in The Hague. That's what I would like to see. This is Blair's second appearance before Sir John Chilcott. He's been recalled to clarify certain aspects concerning his evidence on the invasion of Iraq in March 2003. Justice! Now!